It's 325 in the morning and we're getting ready to start a day of treadwear testing. We're in San Angelo, Texas. The reason we're here in San Angelo is because our terrain is dry, the roads are very severe, and is aggressive for the federal regulations that we run for treadwear testing. Our route starts here at San Angelo, Texas. We run a south route to Sonora, and then from Sonora on to 189, we go down into Juneau, which is part of the federal government regulated treadwear course. We turn around, come back through Sonora, back into San Angelo, and up on our north loop, which is in Robert Lee, we run that twice. We run it clockwise and then counterclockwise. So it's going to be a long day. We're going to be uh, following the convoy. They're going to be traveling 500 miles just on this one leg alone. The reason why we use light duty pickups is because we can load the corners of the vehicle precisely to seize the same load. We'll run these tires a thousand miles a day and every morning we'll bring the tires in, clean them off, reset the air pressures, and I'll measure tread depth. And we'll do that continuously for 16,000 miles to project mileage and how well the tires are doing. This is only one slice of the puzzle here. We have this one convoy running 16,000 miles. It will be repeated three more times with additional tires. We're going to have accumulated over a half million vehicle miles by the time we're done with this program. The only way to tell people how a tire will wear is to do our comparative tread wear testing, where we can test all the tires together under the same conditions. We run in a convoy, in this particular convoy there's four of us, and uh, we communicate by CB radio. I've been doing this about four and a half years. I haven't really had any real bad experiences. There's a bunch of deer, you know, you might hit a deer now and then and everything. If foxes, anything, it's down there in the wild, it, we, we'll see it probably. This is what happens, deer runs out, and we drive a lot of our time in the dark, so we, we do hit a lot of deer, and there, there's a lot of damage to these vehicles. most remote section of the course that I believe we're on today. I have no cell phone service at all. FM radio is hard to get. It's the turnaround point. The first shift is over. It was a really a grueling shift. We ran about 10 to 12 hours today. Today's a busy day. They put it on 500 miles but they're gonna go back out tonight and do the same thing over again. This test just shows what great lengths we'll go to to provide information to the consumer on how long tires will last. 